Today I'm going to be showing you how to download and get started on your genogram using GenoPro. Um, you're going to go ahead and go to genopro.com. You'll click on download GenoPro and click on try it free. Uh, you'll start downloading the file. Make sure you click run. If you have any questions, they do have uh, a successful installing um, gear here. So make sure that you click accept the agreement to continue installing. Um, if you have a setup error, make sure that you follow the information here to try uh, rebooting and they have several questions and answers here um, as far as upgrading or uninstalling GenoPro after you're finished with the genogram assignment, that is perfectly appropriate. Um, once you have that installed, then uh, here's what your map is going to look like. Some tips here, uh, a few tips to get started. To add new family, make sure you press the letter F. Um, that'll have the family wizard. Um, you'll add parents. Select one individual, press the letter P. To add a son or daughter to an existing family, press the letter S or D respectively add a second spouse. Um, each of these different things will help you here. You can add pictures if you would like to your family tree. That's perfectly appropriate. Um, I keep this up, so I, I minimize that right here. Um, so, da, 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 da. so we're going to make sure that we have, um, with our files here, we'll click F. And so husband or father, let's start um, with you. So you'll put your father's name. Uh, make sure that you put the middle name if you know it. And date of birth. Almost got his birthday wrong. And my father happens to still be alive. So. All right, so once you have that in there, we're gonna just stick them right there. All right, and then as you add more family members, um, adding, again, remember that you are pressing F for family. Um, you can go more than that with parents. So, um, so if I click P right here, and so forth. So make sure that you follow the instructions. Again, if you have any questions, um, they do have specific things that you can add and they have frequently asked questions. They're more than happy to help you with this, as am I.